Kimberly Elizabeth and I would like to welcome you back to my channel Bookkeeping Journey. Today's video I'm going to be talking to you about bookkeeping courses and because of Eunice Mason she asked a question that was made that's going to be made into a video and I will read her question right now before I get into the video. So Eunice asks, and I will put it on the screen so you can follow along. Planning to take more courses on bookkeeping? I do have the secret book. I love it. Okay, Eunice. So I'm going to answer the bookkeeping courses bit, and then I'll talk probably a little bit on the secret book and if, um, if I've read it. After I've talked about the bookkeeping courses. I've already done Bookkeeper Launch, and as you know, Eunice, because you are one of the members in Bookkeeper Launch, you purchase the course as well, and we know what we get in there. And because I get, we get so much information, I don't see no, any need to be doing any more bookkeeping courses. My whole philosophy on it, about these bo different bookkeeping courses is, if you take one, you do not have to take another one. So let's say that you go and you take the Bookkeeper Life course, then you don't need to come and do BBL. If you probably go and take Morgan's course, that's the lady from Fine Points, then you don't need to go and do BBL. Bookkeeping, once you have the mind for it, is like an easy subject. I guess for me, it's like I love numbers, so if it's your passion, you will catch on. Uh, once you're learning, you get to learn the basis of bookkeeping and QuickBooks Online, you are fine, you are good to go. And in regards to me, I did the Bookkeeper Launch course, but I am also doing my ACCA to become, let me see if you can get it there. So I'm also doing my ACCA and to become a certified accountant that is like a CPA, but this is more global. It's, it came out of England, it came, this came out of the UK. So I'm studying that right now. And I'm actually doing the bookkeeping part of it because we have to do the bookkeeping part before we can actually get to do the accounting part and, and taxes and all that. That's in further sessions. In later sessions, I, I will say. So they start you all. If you start, if you start ACCA from the foundations, like how I did, I did not go to school and get a degree and all that. I was not that privileged. I was not able to. And then there's some people that finish school, so let me not let me use privilege. I was not, I did not go to school. I I finished high school, and then I went straight to work, and now I started back studying. I did my certificates, account certificates before, and I did the foundations in accounting. Then that I came and did bookkeeper launch, and then I'm also studying my ACCA. So there's no way that I'm taking any more bookkeeping courses. In regards to you, and if you should take more bookkeeping courses. I think that if you take one bookkeeping course, you do not need to be taking any more bookkeeping courses. Just take the information that you learn from that course and apply it to your business. If there's anything extra that you need to learn or you, or you think that they missed out or you think that they didn't talk about enough in the course, go on Google, go on YouTube, come hear a message and ask me a question. And I will definitely do like how I'm doing Eunice Mason! I had to do that. I was so tempted. So how I'm showing her out and making a video on her question. And so you can come, you can come here, ask me a question, and I will definitely give you the answer to the best of my ability. And we all know this if you have watched any of my past videos. So back to the, sorry, I always ramp on rave after and I get so passionate. You should not be taking any additional bookkeeping courses unless um, you want to, but I would say no, just focus on your business because how I look at it is, you're taking a bookkeeping course, you bought this bookkeeping course, you went and buy this bookkeeping course, and you are always side to side, bookkeeping course, bookkeeping course, bookkeeping course, bookkeeping course. You're never doing bookkeeping business. And that's the reason why I'm sure you took the first bookkeeping course in the first place. So, do not be procrastinating and taking the, the fear route in building your business. Make sure that you take a bookkeeping course and then elevate yourself to get that first client, second client and build your business. If you want to take, if you want to become an accountant now, you want to go and do CPA 
or you want to go back to school and do a degree, definitely I am 100% for going and studying those things because uh, as if you love bookkeeping or you love accounting like I do, you will want to further your studies and that's completely understandable. I would never tell anybody do not go back to school and get a degree or go and get a, a certification uh, to be a certified accountant, be a certified bookkeeper. I would not tell you that because I always believe in uh, getting to the next level in my studying in anything that I am doing in life. And I am doing my ACCA, so uh, <laughs> I'll be really wrong to do that. So anyhow, that's it on um, bookkeeping courses. And I hope that that answered your question, Yunez. The next one now, you just mentioned that you have the secret book. Well, I never read the secret book, but I watched the movie must be a thousand times now. I watched that movie so much over the years. And then, along with the secret book, if you know Rhonda Byrne and you, Rhonda Byrne, Rhonda Byrne, and you are a fan of her as like I am, yes, she does the foundation, which is law of attraction, a manifestation, but it does work, right? If you if you know what I'm talking about. And she, so this is completely straight off of our but keeping topic because I'm answering the second part of Yune's question. So yeah, so Rhonda Byrne, she has a book, uh, she has The Power, and I've read that one, but I haven't read The Secret, but The Secret book is the same as that thing I think of that the video is. So that's why I never read the book because the video is the same thing and I'm a visual person. And so I read The Power and I did The Magic. The Magic is a 28 day exercise of gratitude so you do 28 days different exercise you have 28 days and every day is a gratitude exercise and it teaches you how to be more grateful and appreciate the things that you have already in your life i used the magic i got my when i first did the magic i got my first car i manifested my first car that was so amazing and I did it with a group of ladies, it was like about five of us, and we all, well, majority of us by the end of the class, by the end of the 28 days, we had attracted what we wanted. So, yeah, I, I, I love the law of attraction, I do, I do love it, I love it, I love it a lot. And I will probably be mentioning it more on my channel, and as you guys get, as you guys get to know me, because I don't only want to bring you along my bookkeeping journey, but bring you all over so that you can get to know me a lot better and you know when you know somebody a lot better you get to trust them more because i'm that person if i feel like you're being too vague with me well i kind of like step off because i like people to be honest with me because i'm very honest with people as much as i can and uh, that's it for the video and thank you again Eunice Mason thank you so much for the idea for this video and for your comment and girl you've got another video coming tomorrow so thank you again may you guys enjoy the rest of your day and i thank you so much for watching bye